Hello, Treasure Valley. I'm Rick. And I'm Sue Ellen. With our amazing team, we're Diamond Heating, Cooling, Plumbing, and Electric. Together with Idaho News 6, let's hand things over to our host, Nicole Sanchez, who will introduce you to this month's deserving recipient. Thanks so much, Rick and Sue Ellen. This month's winner of the Shine a Light Award is the Idaho Battle of the Books, and we're here with their Vice President, Amy Armstrong. Congratulations. Thank you so much. This is such a fun nonprofit, and it's statewide. Tell us about what you're doing to promote reading. So we like to say it's like sports, but with books. There's teams of four. They read a pre-selected group of books, and then they answer questions about the books, earn points, and they battle against each other and it's all the way across the state of Idaho. That's great, how many youth participate? And is it middle school and high school? We have elementary, middle school, junior high, and high school. Last year we had about 100 schools participating across the state, and we had eight regional tournaments. That's amazing. And what gave you the idea for this, and, and when did it start? It started back in 2017, and there was a group of people who thought, we need something for kids who love to read. And so we looked at some programs around the area, and we chose one that we liked and made it, made it the Idaho way. It's so fun, congratulations. Thank you. Rick and Sue Ellen, back to you. Thanks for joining us, Treasure Valley. We're proud to recognize the hardworking people in our community who are making a positive impact on all our lives. Go to idahonews6.com forward slash shine a light and nominate those who you think truly deserve it the most.